If you have a caravan, then two things are likely to be true. The first is that it will probably have an Alco chassis and stabilizer hitch. The second is that your insurance will stipulate that you have a hitch lock as a security device. So in this video, I'm going to compare the older Alco hitch lock with the new premium model to see what the differences are and whether it is worth the upgrade. Hi, it's Dave T here, and we've had the same Alco hitch lock since we purchased our first van almost 20 years ago. It's looking a bit tatty now, and I've always suspected that it could probably be removed with a strong crowbar. So with that in mind, I've upgraded to Alco's newer Safety Premium model. The Safety Premium comes in a simple cardboard box with some photos, basic information, and the all-important Sold Secure logo. There's no plastic packaging, and inside you'll find the lock, two keys, and a multi-language instruction booklet. On three sides of the box, there are 12 different hitch options listed, so make sure you pick the correct lock for your specific caravan hitch. The booklet does include some instructions for how to prepare certain Alco hitch types for use with the lock. This looks like a simple enough task with the bolting of two small receiver plates either side of the hitch body. These were not required for our 2004 stroke 3004 hitch and were not supplied with our lock model. So as mentioned, check your hitch type and lock model first. If you are familiar with the older Alco hitch lock, then the first thing you'll notice is the weight of this version. Weighing in at just under five kilos, it's more than three kilos heavier than the old version. It's also notably bigger due to the taller side plates and the sturdy locking bar, which with a diameter of 37 millimeters is more than strong enough to withstand most attacks. The weight mainly comes from the materials used, with the side plates fabricated from 10 millimeter thick steel. The handle cover is made with three millimeter steel with all of the seams welded. Our original Alco lock was made from three millimeter steel with several critical locking elements welded onto the pressed body, so much less robust. All of this combines to give the Alco Safety Premium Sold Secure Gold certification. Sold Secure is an independent organization that tests security devices and ranks them with bronze, silver, gold, and now also diamond ratings. It's worth bearing in mind that the tests that Sold Secure use change over time to take into account different tools and methods that criminals use. So that means that a Sold Secure Gold lock purchased several years ago may now only be a silver or not even certified at all. Also, the ratings relate to the value of the asset being protected. So for example, a sold secure gold bicycle lock is not as secure as a sold secure gold motorcycle lock and so on. In terms of other features, there is a robust plastic rotatable weather shield to cover the key lock. And the keys, by the way, are from CES, which is the same lock company as the lock on the original red lock. To avoid the caravan being towed away with a makeshift hook, the tow ball receiver well must be blocked and this is achieved with the Alco safety ball. This does not come with the lock, so if you don't have one already, you'll need to purchase one for about £7 and these are available from Alco and also several other manufacturers. So with the basic details of the lock covered, let's head over to the caravan to see how it works in practice. Unless the caravan is hitched to the tow car, you should fit the Alco safety ball into the tow ball by lifting the hitch lever and inserting the ball and then lowering the lever again. To fit the lock, rotate the weather shield, insert the key and turn it just under a quarter turn clockwise until the lock body pops out. The retaining bar can now be slid out and there's a slight flange at the end of the bar to give your fingers some extra purchase. Next, lower the lock directly onto the hitch with the two metal lugs aligned with the slots on the hitch body. Then slide the retaining bar back in, press the lock in, and then turn the key back counterclockwise. With the bar in place, the only way the lock can now be removed is by picking or drilling the lock, or by cutting the main lock body. With modern battery-powered tools, this is of course possible, but only with considerable noise and probably time. The rearward-facing location of the key lock not only gives it additional protection from the elements, but also restricts the angles possible for drilling the lock. Once in place, the hitch handle cannot be lifted, which in combination with the safety ball makes it very difficult to, to attach the trailer to another vehicle, or indeed detach it from an existing vehicle. As you can see, the sides of the body also cover the hitch bolts, ensuring that the attacker could not just remove the hitch and use an alternative one. One of the key features of the Alco lock is that it can be used not just to secure the caravan when pitched or attached to the towing vehicle, but also whilst actually driving. Now this is a controversial idea with some people, but it is worth bearing in mind that the way the hitch and lock work means that it has no impact on the safety whilst towing or indeed in a crash. 
With this design, the caravan's hitch can be secured at all times other than when hitching or unhitching the van. To me, the Alco Safety Premium is far more robust and secure than its smaller sibling. Our older lock was made from flimsier material with effectively two di diagonally opposed fixing points. The first is here where the lug and lock pin fits into the keyed slot on the hitch body and the second is at the front of the lever hood where this shaped notch latches onto the hitch in front of the lever. Now I'm not an expert on locks or thankfully a criminal but I imagine a correctly shaped crowbar applied at the right spot would likely just break away the older lock. This would confirm the stories told by several people that experienced caravan thieves can remove the old style lock in seconds. The premium model wraps around the entire hitch, so as far as I can tell, could only be removed by cutting the body or drilling or picking the lock. But you don't have to take my word for it, as Safety Premium is at present the only one of the free Alco locks that is certified sold secure caravan and trailer gold. At about £140, the Alco Safety Premium is roughly £50 more than the silver version of the old style lock but significantly less, surprisingly, than the red version, which I've seen online for over £250. I hope you found this video interesting or helpful, and if you have, then please do hit that like button. And if you're interested in seeing other videos that I make, then please consider subscribing to my channel. But most of all, thanks for watching.